I work with children with complex communication needs that use a variety of communication systems that of course then have to be mounted for adequate access. I've been doing this for, well, almost 15 years. And so I've kind of come across a lot of different issues and different needs. It takes many eyes on the clients and then also getting digging into what's going to work for them. So it's been awesome working together with a bunch of different team members to more or less accomplish the same goal um, in regards to meeting those mounting service needs through a VMS. But something that we can just trust that it won't malfunction um, when we aren't readily accessible. I really like the mock-up feature where I get a, a picture that kind of shows what the mount will look like. Mm -hmm. And so just the ability to say, this is what I'm wanting. You know, I'm always holding a book or something where I want the item to be mounted. Usually their response is, oh, that's what you meant. <laughs> With the, um, the patient that was your 10,000th, her response was, that's exactly what I was hoping for. She had another mount that was more rigid and didn't work with her tray. So there was just a lot of issues with her previous mount. And so when she got the pictures back, she was, I think, relieved that it was exactly what she was hoping for. She was the inspiration for our AAC program. I was pleasantly surprised with how quickly the mount went on and did exactly what we were hoping for. The fact that Readapt does a great job of sending additional bolts, additional spacers. I think that, you know, we left there with more materials um, just because you guys had very well thought through um, needing and troubleshooting through different tube diameters in the event that we have to clamp it onto a tube. Um, but I think on the front end, if you take the pictures and take the time and truly request the CAD, which you guys do endlessly, um, that, you know, we've done all we can do, at least in our capacity, to make sure that it matches well. And if things change because, you know, different ages, different expectations, different functional mm -hmm. outcomes, we adapt with them. So I think it kind of speaks for itself in the name.